हाई एंड वेलकम मैसेज अथेंटिकेशन कोड और मैक इज अ शॉर्ट पीस ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन और अ टैग दैट वी अटैच विद अ मैसेज दैट वी इंटेंड टू सेंड टू अ रेसिपियंट नाउ दिस मैसेज अथेंटिकेशन कोड बेसिकली एनश्योर्स द रेसिपियंट ऑफ दिस मैसेज दैट द मैसेज हैज नॉट बीन चेंज ड्यूरिंग द ट्रांजिट एंड द मैसेज हैज कम फ्राम आ ट्रस्टेड पार्टी Now this HMAC or hash message authentication code is a type of message authentication code. In this video I will discuss both of these codes by using animation. Now first of all message authentication code. So a sender wants uh, to send a message to a receiver in a way that receiver be confident about the origin of uh, this message. and the message has not been changed during the transit so sender then take this message and hash it and then uh, he uses a key and this key and hash of this message or the digest of this message are combined in a mac algorithm to generate the message authentication code now this message authentication code is also called tag of this message and this uh, message authentication code is used to authenticate this message to the receiver now uh, the sender then sends uh, this message and uh, the along with its mac now the receiver then uh, perform similar steps and he uh, hashes Uh, this message and then uses the same key that is the same symmetric key or the key is similar on both sides and he then generates its own mac then uh, the receiver then compares the both macs the mac which is received from the sender and the mac which he has created at its own and if bo both macs are similar then it means that the message has come from the trusted party and it has not been changed now this hmac is uh, similar to the uh, mac the only difference is that in hmac we do not use the key directly in mac algorithm rather this key is used to generate two keys now these both sub keys or the two sub keys are subsequently used with the message to hack, generate a hash so this message is combined with the first sub key or con con concatenated with this first sub key and then together with the key it is hashed so this is the major difference between the mac and the hmac that in mac we hash the message and then the hash of this message is used with the key uh, whereas in hmac we do not hash the message directly rather we concatenate it with the sub key and then we carry out hash of this entire product then this first hash is again uh, used with the second sub key to generate this second hash now this second hash is basically the hash message authentication code over here now after generating this hashed message authentication code the sender sends it to the receiver now the receiver then carries out similar steps that he creates two sub keys out of the primary key and then he uses these two keys in series to generate his own h h mac and then he compares the h mac which was received 
uh, from the sender and the the hmac which he has generated itself and if both values are same then it means that the message has not been changed during the transit and the message has come uh, from the right party now there is one issue with this hmac and mac uh, that there is no non repudiation because the same key is shared on both sides so anyone can later on deny that he has not sent this message because the key is available uh, uh, to both parties so this was all from my side please stay connected to my channel for similar videos thank you